Hello YouTube, it's been a long time. I thought I would post a video about my pedal board that I have now. Um, it's long since upgraded since the last time I've done this, so uh, not much has really changed in the delay in Reaver apartment, but uh, everything else has pretty much changed. Uh, first and foremost, the bigger pedal board that I have. Now what we have here for the pedal board is a Friedman pedal board. Um, the exact one, I don't remember what it is, but I will leave a link in the description below when it's, I'm done with this video. Um, so let's start off with uh, the newest thing first. Okay, right here we have a Jerry Cantrell wall. I'm a huge fan of Jerry Cantrell, and especially for his sound, what he goes for. Um, seeing how I have an Eagle 34 amp, as well as a 606 amp, I uh, thought it'd be nice to blend those together, but since Jerry's sound is purely an EL34 sound, um, it blends very nicely with my Invader that I have. Um, another bonus thing about it is that it has this nice uh, cue here, this little knob right here that allows me to uh, adjust the cue to my liking, whether it being a darker sound or a brighter sound. It is all dependent on my liking for that uh, for the instance of me playing guitar. Anyways, so there's that bit. These two pedals over here are Walrus Audio pedals that I just recently got uh, last year. Uh, the one to the right is called the Juliana. That is a brand new pedal from Walrus Audio Effects. That is a stereo chorus. That is um, one of my favorite choruses ever. It has... A lot of features for what it is. I know it's only four knobs, but it's also a stereo outs, which you'll see right there. The outs are right there. So if I wanted to, I can use the stereo outs on the 580 into that and then put it in two cabs, and you would have a stereo setup going in there, which is really nice for that chimey stuff that's like chorus and whatnot. Um, it's really nice. Now, the one left to that one is the Lillian, which has a very similar layout which is really cool i I'm all, I'm all about pretty similar layouts and keeping it simple this is actually a oh what is it called it's a um a flanger on this one this one's a flanger and i really like how that one sounds uh as you see it's a six and four stage um flanger and it has the same kind of uh you know set up as the Lillian, the knobs wise, everything's all the same except for the mini toggle right here and the stereo outs as well. On our top right over here we have a noise gate by <laughs> I'm sorry Jordan, I always forget your brand name. Um, this is my friend's um, um, brand that he has um, and uh, that's his logo. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm going to link the all the video, the pedals after I'm done with this video um, in the description below of what they are. Uh, this is a noise gate. Since the 580 doesn't come with a noise gate, unlike its brother over here that it does with built in, um, I had to buy a noise gate for this monstrous 580, uh, which I got this. And he specifically built this for my angle amps which is quite nice uh shout out to jordan gale really thank you so much man appreciate you uh high wind there you go this his brand is called high wind high wind pedals high wind amps and then lastly but not least we have an angle z15 pedal bolt foot switch that i've yet to even figure out still i'm st i still have this i did a video on this but I, figured, I found out I was wrong on a lot of things, and I'm still wrong about what it does now. So I still got to learn about MIDI and how it all works and everything. Because as you see, it's pretty complicated. It, it starts talking about all this stuff right here, banks and modes and stuff on all of this. And this pedal board, oh, foot switch, sorry, they don't make anymore. And it was specifically made for the 580 right here. So... Um, that's basically my pedal board. This is say the same ever since for like the last three years now, three four years I've had these pedals, and uh, they've been great. Um, the only additions is the wah, the noise gate. Um, this I've had for a while, which is the the lip splitter that I really like. 
uh, it enables me to have two amps on at one time, which is quite nice. Um, and then these two pedals right here from Walrus Audio, I like them. So right now I have Walrus Audio, Empress, and Walrus, uh, Cry Baby, Wah, High, Wand, High Wind, Amplification, uh, Nerd Knuckle Effects, um, Lip Splitter, and an Angle Foot Switch. That is my pedal board for this video. If you have any questions about any of this stuff, that's cool. I will address them in the comments below. Um, if you guys like the gear that I have, leave a like below. I love gear and I love talking about it. I love sharing it and um, offering my support to people who are interested in getting better tone. Um, and then this is my amps that I have, like I said before. So, um, cool. I hope you guys enjoy and enjoy your weekend. Thank you. Weekend, weekday, whatever. Thank you.